I just wanted to show you this. Look, I'm sitting inside my observatory tent. Um, if I turn the flash, you will see how dark it is. I will do it now for a moment. Yeah, completely dark. And just to abstract even the front of the view, which there is a light somewhere, street light, that practically blocks that light also, this flap door of the tent. Really the best thing I've got <laughs> so far for, you know, yeah, avoiding the light pollution. You cannot really win. Uh, the councils, the people, you know, nobody cares about anything. Light pollution for them is nothing. They are ignorant mostly. Or if they are in council, they're just Freemasons and they just nothing they, they will do without bribe or something. Anyway. Uh, so this tent saved me all that hassle. And I'm sitting in my tent and my eyes are adopted to darkness and I can see a lot of more details now with the refractor. Oh, it's lovely. The best thing I've done. And I'm sitting inside my observatory tent, which is a pop-up privacy tent. And this is my finder eyepiece, uh, uh, super puzzle, 26 millimeter mid, uh, just easy to you know put in the eyepiece holder and just find the target, center it, and go for the high magnification. And this is nice here; it's quite protected, light pollution non-existent and when I turn off the flash which is completely dark let me just show you what is outside I'm just putting the camera out so you can see that's the one big light there are several of them around here this is the second one and then when I go in I will come back to the tent now again you see this is my observatory pop-up <laughs> observatory and I turned off the flash you can see and now I turn it on and that's it Ta -da! I'm observing and my eyes when the flash is off of course uh, are well adapted to the darkness I can see a lot of more details I'm more comfortable I'm sitting actually on an observing chair which has different heights I can adjust it really good uh, exercise in that